Hey y'all, what's up? It's your girl Crystal, also known as Good Girl Gone Fashion, and welcome back to my channel. <laughs> Make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Make sure you are subscribed to my channel and make sure you're following me on instagram at good girl gone fashion today we're going thrifting again <laughs> so um we are at chkd um it's a thrift store in my area but actually i'm on the other side of town but it's only like one it's one of the only thrift stores that we have open on Sundays here so I do have like a little list of some items that I would like to find um some bright blazers maybe some basic um tanks for spring and um some colored like button-ups men's always statement earrings and I believe trousers so yeah just some things that I'm looking for and that I'll keep an eye out for so just gonna browse around see what they have I got my mask I got my tripod so yeah I'm excited to thrift and see what I can find and of course if I see anything else that I can't pass up and it's coming home with me. So, let's get started. Hey everyone, so I am entering the thrift store and as you all know, my first stop is always going to be the accessories, if the thrift store has some. Now, on this particular day, um, CHKD did not have much of a selection, but I still, you know, took my time to look to see what I could find. And I did spot a pair of earrings that you will see coming up that definitely stood out to me. And I had to check them out further, but I went to go look at the necklaces first. And then, of course, I went back to the ones that I saw. And y'all, I just love these. $3.98, yes. These are coming home with me. So, I definitely snagged these up and told her to put those to the side for me. So, I could take those on home with me. Now, I didn't see much else. So, I eventually just went ahead and got a shopping cart to start my shopping. Now, with the list that I gave you all when I first um, started the video, I kind of stuck to it, but then I kind of didn't. I first was looking through like the basic color tops to see if I could see anything, and I came across this wrap like blouse and I like the fact that it was like a nice white neutral color it didn't have any stains or anything like that so I went ahead and threw that in the cart and let's just see what else I was able to find
Also, yes, I know we're looking for spring items, but I could not pass up this new with tags. Fashion Nova maxi dress. I thought it was a cute staple. And look at this statement bag. I went ahead and added that to my cart. And now I don't know what I was saying exactly, but I'm about to show y'all some trousers that I found. These like coral linen pants. These, one, these ones were more of a fuchsia and the lavender ones as well. Then I eased over to the men's section to look through their trousers. They didn't have much, um, but what I find you will later see in the try on portion. I had to pull my hair back because it just got way too hot up in there. For you all when I um, try them on and do the haul um, so yeah and I I know y'all are probably like why did you get that black dress well it has like a mock turtleneck which I I love and even though it's long sleeves it's very like lightweight material and I feel like it would be cool it would be good for cool spring nights like I could pair that with a sandal or a sneaker. I could roll the sleeves up and just have like a, a simple, nice, clean look. So that's why I got the black dress. Um, I did not care for how in the men's trousers you could see like the lines so you couldn't see through it. But I don't know if it's because I had on these black leggings underneath it so i'm gonna try it when i get home like paired by themselves and if i need to cut that lining out i will so um but they fit great and i think they would be perfect for sandals they were a good length on me and um i really wanted some trousers and i just got the coral linen pants because um i feel like they would be paired I feel like they would be cute paired with a bodysuit like in that same like color scheme to give like a nice monochromatic look. So I'm going to go home and I'm going to wash all this stuff and I'm going to style it up for you all and yeah we'll see how everything turned out and I didn't find as many basic tops as I wanted to but the um, top that I did find the white wrap top I feel like that's just a nice basic to have I feel like it would be paired well with just about anything so I'm excited to see how that's gonna look I hope that works out and the bag that I got is to sell so that is not um, for me to keep for myself that is for me to sell so yeah Let's see how we style these pieces up. That was a pretty successful, quick thrift trip. Um, and those earrings, I actually really like them. I think, you know, they're just everything. So I like the color. I like that they're kind of like clear, like see-through. So yeah, I am excited about those. So yeah, let's go home and wash and style these pieces up 
and let's see what we can come out with. And I spent $44 for everything. So everything was $44. So yeah. Let's see what we got for $44. Hey y'all, welcome back to the thrift haul portion of this video. So yeah, I just wanted to come on here and show you all what I picked up from CHKD. So I've been being very intentional with um, thrifting or just shopping in general because I already have so much stuff. I do not want to overload my closet anymore like that. So I've been tr trying to like dwindle away pieces on top of adding pieces that I will be able to wear more and style in different ways. So I am consistently maximizing my wardrobe and getting the most bang for my buck. So with that being said, I have um, one bag, a pair of earrings and some clothes I'm gonna share with you all. And um, CHKD is one of the thrift stores in my area. I live in Richmond, Virginia. CHKD is one of the thrift stores in my area that is open on Sundays. Goodwills in Richmond are now closed on Sundays. Womp womp. <laughs> but anywho, I don't want to keep rambling. Um, for those of you who are going to ask, my earrings are from Shein. I recently just did them in the Shein haul. And my top is old from, I want to say Boohoo. And it just has like, like bell bottom sleeves. But yes. So the first thing I want to show you that I got from CHKD are these earrings, y'all. <laughs> now... Y'all are just getting to know me. But from what y'all have learned so far, y'all should know that I love a statement earring. And when I saw these, I just had to have them. I thought these would be so perfect for spring and summer. They were $3.98. Y'all, I just love how... Um, this piece is see-through. I love the color. I love that they look like a door knocker, which is my favorite style of earrings. So I picked these up. So the next accessory that I wanna show you is a unique bag that I found. I haven't been thrifting much bags lately because I haven't been seeing any, but if I come across something that's different or unique, I'm gonna grab it. And I just thought that this was so different so it looks like it has this rope detail like throughout the bag and this opens yeah so you would just open it like this this was $7.98 it has a pretty like floral pattern in the inside. Um, this is definitely gonna be something that I'm gonna sell. I do not know who makes this bag at all. I'm trying to look at the, I'm not sure. But I like how it has the loops on both sides. And then you have the rope detailing going through it with the fringe at the bottom. I just feel like for someone who likes unique unique bags, this is like a perfect bag for like fall and winter when you're more um, prone to carrying more stuff. So yes, I just wanted to pick this up and share this with you all. And it has feet at the bottom. It's in really good shape, so. Yep, I picked that up and everything else is closed and I'm also going to do like a try on and I styled these pieces up so go me. <laughs> but yeah, I styled these pieces up so you can see 
what I had in mind when I purchased the pieces. But I, um, I picked up this black dress. It has a mock neck and the dress is from Fashion Nova. And it's just a long black maxi dress that's fitted. And also another thing that I really liked about this dress is that on the sleeves, it has the, you know, cut out that you could put like your thumb through. And even though this is like a black dress and you're thinking, oh my God, well spring and summer coming up, you have those cool nights where you just want to be comfortable and warm and you just want something, you know, stretchy. If you're at like a cookout or a function, something you can move around in easy. And um, being that the dress is so fitted, um, you know, it can show off a lot of problem areas that you may have and you may want to hide that. So that's why I paired it with um, the fanny pack. And I just paired it also with some sneakers to dress the look down to kind of give it a more casual vibe. Now you can um, throw on like a necklace and some earrings and a heel and you could totally be sexy and turn this into a whole nother look. So it just kind of depends on your vibe and what you're going for. But you can go either way. I, I just definitely really like this. And it was brand new with um it was brand new with tags. So I picked that up. And I also picked up this pink. Yeah, and all these, the only thing that I will not be keeping is the bag. I will only be selling the bag. The, I'm keeping the earrings and all the clothes I wanted for myself to kind of like amp up my spring wardrobe. So I also found this pretty pink mesh. I just love this. This um this pretty pink mesh turtleneck that's completely sheer. I this is in a 2X and I believe that Fashion Nova dress is in a 1X. And I also found these pink linen, well like coral pants. And I just actually, I just paired them together. I just felt like it would be a nice um, monochromatic look. I put some like pink fur heels on with it, grabbed a pink bag and I have a whole monochromatic look from the thrift store that, not the heels, the heels are old from Forever 21, but just a nice pink monochromatic look. The bag that you're seeing that I paired it with, the um, flower bag, I thrifted that from Goodwill a couple of years ago and I'm never getting rid of that bag. It's like perfect for this time of year. It's a conversation piece and I just felt like it would be paired great with these items as a nice monochromatic look, a nice sleek and clean look as well. So I picked those items up and the last two items I paired together as well I found this white linen top. It's from Market and Spruce. It's in a 2X and it's just like a wrap top. So I um, I paired that with these men trousers. And if y'all are not on the trouser trend, I mean, I feel like it's a nice trend that, you know, you would not be upset at trying. It gives you a nice, clean, sleek look. And I just picked up these trousers from the men's section. As I always say, do not forget to um, check out the men's section. But yeah, I just actually really like these. And I thought that paired with this, um, I paired it with my tan, well, they're considered gold, Iran sandals and that white H&M bag that I recently picked up and showed y'all in another haul. And that just gives me a nice, another nice, clean spring summer look that I look so elevated and it just looks like clean lines and I love that. So yeah, and I can't, remember 
what I paid for the pants, but I know they were no more than like $5. And I believe the top was $3. So you got a nice clean look for $8. Yes, $8, <laughs> but yeah, I just wanted to come on here and show you all what I found and show you how I styled the pieces up. Um, you will be seeing these pieces again in probably other hauls, pairing it with different things and things of that nature. So if you enjoyed this, make sure you give this video a thumbs up, um, drop a comment below and let me know which piece was your fave or if you will be thrifting any of these items to try to elevate your spring or summer wardrobe as well. And that is it. Until my next video. Toodle.